channel Vlogger Sir. So, today in this video, I'll be going to show you some DIYs which you can use to decorate your room. So, without any further ado, let's begin. <laughs> So for the first DIY, you will need a sheet of paper, some sketch pen, water, a plastic sheet and a flat brush. So first, we will take the size of the paper on the polythene sheet. So here I have marked the size of my sheet of paper. Now I will be using pink sketch pen, green, blue sketch pen and the purple sketch pen and yellow for coloring the area. So for making faded paper first we need to color the marked area. In this making of faded paper, I have used these five colors because they give the most attractive look for the faded paper. So now the next step is pouring the water on this sketch pen. So now here I am taking some water with the help of the brush and pouring it all over the plastic sheet. Now I will be taking the sheet of paper and keeping it on the sketch pens. Uh, press it from all the sides so that the water is absorbed. After pressing it properly, lift the field paper and keep it aside. So here is the outcome of the faded paper. Now wait for the faded paper to dry up or also you can use the hair dryer to dry it. Here also I have made some variations in the size of the faded papers and I have also used some different combinations. Now you will need a photo frame and some paper clips, small paper clips. I have already added a string to the photo frame to tug all these faded papers. You can also use your photos to tug on these strings. In addition that you can also color these wooden clips to make it more attractive. You can also add a border of the washi tape.
Nope. Nope. So guys, as you have seen that in this way, I am not able to organize my books. So I have a DIY for this. So for the second DIY, you will need a glass mug, some stones and some artificial flowers or plants which are optional. In this way, you can organize your books beautifully. For the next DIY, we are going to make a unicorn hat. And for that, you will need some color paper and a golden glitter sheet. For making the flowers, cut out the shape from the paper. Now, Give it a small cut from the bottom and stick both the ends to each other. Now fold the top part with the help of a pencil to give a petal like shape. Just do the same with all the other petals. Now take a yellow colored chart paper or a colored paper and fold it in half and cut like this from the bottom. Now fold it with the help of the pencil to give it a round like shape. Now press it from the center. Now take a circle chart paper and stick all the petals which we had made on it. Now stick the yellow flower which we had made on the center. So now our flower is ready. So let's make the unicorn horn. For making the horn take any glitter sheet and cut it in this shape. Let's make its ears. For making the ears, take two colored papers, cut it in this shape and stick it together. For the eyes, take the black colored paper, draw the eyes and cut it up. So now our unicorn head parts are ready. Now I will show you how to assemble all the parts to make your unicorn head. So I have taken a cut out from the cardboard just as the shape of a frame. I have painted it green and added a flower which we had just seen how to make it in the previous DIY. So our DIY frame is ready. You can use this picture frame in two ways. First, you can stick the picture and hang it on the wall. Second, you can hold this picture frame in your hand and click the picture. 
So that is it for today. I hope that you will try this DIYs at your home. If you have enjoyed watching my video, like it, share it and also subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon to get notified when I post the next video. Thank you for watching.